goals is to read more for 2022 so um i hope these books are good so first of course we got manga i really like the yona of the dawn series so my sisters and i were really excited when we saw these at the library the art is just so much better on paper next i got two marie kondo books um joy at work and the life changing magic of tidying up I heard these were really popular so I picked them up. I normally don't read science fiction but I saw this book The Swimmers and it caught my eye. And finally this book is 24-6 The Power of Unplugging One Day a Week. <laughs> done with my classes for today, I thought it'd be a great time to show you guys my new Notion template for the new year. So thank you so much to Notion for sponsoring this portion of the video. And of course, thank you, thank you, thank you to you guys for making opportunities like this possible for me. Notion is a great organizational tool for managing your tasks, setting goals, and taking notes. It's free to download, so I'll leave a link in the description in case any of you guys want to try out Notion for yourself. So this is my Notion for 2022. Um, I can't take credit for it because I just mixed a bunch of different templates that I liked and put it all together. So I'll be sure to leave those down below in the description. This is the navigation for my school stuff. If you click here, this is the university page for all my courses. Um, I'm taking Introduction to Ecology and Behavior, Principles of Behavioral Neuroscience, Introduction to International and Area Studies, and Global Health and Development. I was actually waitlisted in every single class this quarter and I just got into two of them so let's hope Michelle gets into her classes next quarter or this quarter. Then down here is just a calendar view where you can put in any due dates. I just have a big to-do list here in case I just want to throw down something so I don't forget and a daily schedule section in case I want to time block my day. There's a little affirmations um, section here because we all need a little self-love in our lives. So I'm just going to go over some of my goals for the new year to really put them out there and manifest them for 2022. I haven't found a quote of the year yet, so if you guys have any quote recommendations, feel free to comment them down below so I can add them to my notion. Some personal goals is to find my own music taste and sense of fashion because I definitely just copy my sisters because I'm too lazy to do that. Um, keep in touch with my family more, find hobbies outside of YouTube, reduce my screen time, try to read a book a month, 
stop worrying about what other people think and just be yourself and to not overthink every situation and just go with the flow. Moving on to some academic goals, I want to practice more spaced repetition to study a little bit every day, use active recall, um, remind myself why I'm studying so hard, find a research position, enjoy the process of learning, and find study techniques that really work for me. For wellness, I want to journal more and practice gratitude daily, meditate, exercise, wake up early, and to make my apartment a nicer place to live because it's a little undecorated right now. For relationships, I want to get comfortable being the first one to reach out and to make plans, check in on my loved ones more often, have more meaningful conversations with others, find people that share the same energy and vision as me, and to make some internet friends, maybe on YouTube or Instagram. I want to diversify my YouTube videos outside of vlogs, so I hope you guys will still continue watching as I explore different types of videos. Not to get caught up in the analytics, be authentic, don't be afraid to vlog in public and to talk to the camera, which I'm trying to do right now. Um, post a video at least three times a month, post on Instagram three times a month, and to work in a hospital. If you click any one of these, this is just like a page for the quarter and my roommate made this. If you click into any of these week ones, um, she basically made a calendar view and then um, this is just like a weekly to-do list and she made every quarter a different theme. This is a template I found but this is just a habit tracker. I'm trying to read more so this is just a bookshelf of books I'm reading. I'm trying to practice gratitude more often so I'm just going to keep a daily list of gratitude, just a little journaling session to talk about things that I'm grateful for that day. At the bottom, there's just a calendar of every little victory count, so I can put in one little thing that went well that day. That is the Notion template that I'm using for now, and I'll be adding bits and pieces as I go on through the year. So I hope you guys liked um, my Notion. If you want to try out Notion, just feel free to click the link in the description. I'm now enrolled in three classes! One more to go! Hello? Darling, I'd wait for you even if you didn't ask me to I just need that song to come out and I'm back and die Four five! Yeah, oh yeah <laughs> <laughs> I win! I don't get to pay! Okay, well, here's your solution. I think I always get to pay for it. You can lie by the way. There's stone inside the sky.
Alexa, lamp off.
Too.